Cycling can be weird, and the most obvious way that this wonderful sport's eccentricity manifests itself is in its race prizes. So, with that in mind, we decided to draw up a list of the most bizarre podium prizes. But, before we get into it, don't forget to tick that little notification bell so you get told every time we release new content. Kern is known for its donkeys, but what was once a term of derision is now worn with pride by the town. That's why the winner of Kern Brussels Kern is awarded with a little cuddly donkey. That and they need to be a real hard ass to get through one of the toughest races of the year. Nothing says congratulations like a roundel of stinking cheese, but that's exactly what past stage winners of the Tour of Britain have been rewarded with. Their teammates on the team bus must have been absolutely thrilled. If tasty local cheese doesn't float your boat, then how about heading to Austria for some massive sausage? Yet the lucky race leader of the Tour of Austria receives one whopping Weissbauer sausage for every day the jersey is worn. The phrase, going the whole hog, really takes on a different meaning at Trobro Leon, otherwise known as the Tour of Leon. It's a unique race in a number of ways. It's 204 kilometers long, features 25 off-road sections, and includes everything from farm tracks to cobblestones to gravel paths. But perhaps the most unique thing about the Tour of Leon is that it crowns two winners, the actual race winner, and then the first place Breton, who's lucky enough to win a real living piglet. The lucky rider that takes the King of the Mountains jersey in the Arctic race of Norway will be rewarded with a giant salmon toy. If they're lucky enough to take the overall King of the Mountains classification, then they get rewarded with 500 kilograms of prime Norwegian salmon. The lucky winner of Torino Adriatico, a coast-to-coast -coast race in Italy, is bespoke a large trident, the weapon most commonly associated with Neptune, the god of the sea. But the marine theme doesn't end there, and in the days preceding the race, the trident is ceremonially raised from the Tyrrhenian Sea by divers of the Italian Coast Guard. Each time the Vuelta a España visits Toledo, the stage winner receives a Toledo sword, a traditional piece of craftsmanship that dates back to before the Roman times, and every time one is given out, the May equips, good luck getting this through customs. So there you go, a list of our favourite weird and wonderful cycling prizes that have been awarded over the years. If you have any good suggestions, then please let us know in the comments section below, and don't forget to like and subscribe.